Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Jam Pack Cooking. That's right, it's your boy Chef Ray, Mr. Money. I just want to come to you today, quick unboxing and review on our new toys we got. This is official review of Jam Pack Cooking. Let's go. So check this out, man. We got ourselves a Booze Boy. John Booze Boy, this company has been around since 1887. It's almost 125 years, man. That's a long time. So we got the 18 inch walnut finish, uh, three inch thick, 18 inch in diameter, chopping block, cutting board. And this is a breeding, man. We're gonna bust it open. I wanna know. Leave it down in the comment if you own one and let me know what type of experience you had with it. So y'all gonna watch us bust this, bust this baby wide open real quick. She's gonna run a blade right around here, and she's open. Oh man, it feels wonderful to the touch. You can't tell even seams or none of that stuff, because a lot of time when I buy these boards, they have little indents, I mean. Hey, what happened? It's almost perfect. You got one there, but other than that, man, this is beautiful. She's a beaut. <laughs> Just come with a little thing, a little pouch of the board, board cream. It's not much, but we did opt in for the set. Bought this separate. Make sure we can maintenance this board and take care of it because these are not cheap at all. This is the uh, board cream. The board cream basically provides the best protection of the wood and uh, food prep. It leaves a silky wax barrier over the board just uh, for protection. I will be using a lot of this here with the board cream. Another thing that came in the pack that we opted in for is the Mystery R. Recommended to use often on these boards. This is gonna give you your uh, protection. Using this stuff is gonna penetrate deep into the wood, give you optimal moisturization. It's gonna uh, restore and protect and replenish loss of uh, moisture in the board. And it came with, uh, I actually bought an applier in they sell that plier. I mean, of course, you probably can use your own, but this feels pretty good. It's pretty sturdy. It's a good applicator. It's, it's, it's sturdy. It's not one of the cheap brands. You probably you just can't rip that off. Of course, if you apply the right pressure, anything can be done, but pretty sturdy. I like it. Come with a little cover to keep everything locked in. So that's cool. Let's get into the main star of the show. Now, this is not a light board, guys. This stuff, this is heavy. Good girl. <laughs> I opted for the walnut finish because I like a dark wood. I would, if they had anything dark, I would have went with that. Typically, this is made with North American hardwood. Black walnut, hard rock, the maple wood. So these all are hard, good, sturdy woods to give us a good lifespan using this board. Some people invest their money in this stuff and just chop, 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 never moisture their board, try to replenish the board or do anything to protect, protect it against the blades that we're using on these boards. It could take a beating. It's not a wimpy board if I pull my knife out now and got the chopping the onion. I don't think I'm gonna do any damage to this board. Now, I am looking to see if they got any type of uh, anti-scratch or stuff like that, because like I say, this is gonna do the best to re protect it, but we all know once we get the beating and chopping on these boards, you definitely gonna get some scratching and bruises. But that's what they made for. Everything that was described to me before I bought it seems to be true about the booze board. It's a long-term company, it's been around a while, and I mean, you can flip it and use it on both sides. I opted for the, the circle. They have them in all shapes and sizes, circles, squares. Not sure if you can customize them, but I do know I love the circle, so that's the one I got. This one retails for about 470 bucks after taxes, but if you add the kit, the kit retails for about another 50 bucks. I'll leave the link down in the description where I got all my stuff from and the stores that I use to purchase this board. That's it for today on the booze board, man. Y'all will see us using it right here on the channel a lot. Boy, gonna see a lot of onions, peppers. Leave it down in the comment, give me some of your feedback let me know if you own one of these boards or something like it in the booze family we got plenty of videos you guys can go watch i put some up on the screen you can go and check these videos out and see me prep a lot of different uh, recipes and stuff that you might like leave down in the comment what type of recipes you want to see me make right here on this butcher block i think we're gonna start with some ceviche a lot of chopping and, <laughs> and grating listen i appreciate you for tuning in and checking this video out make sure you go check some of my content out i am chef ray mr money this is jam pack cooking until next time Y'all stay jamming and cooking. Peace and love.